Wrestling office? Oh, um, Australia. Yes, I, I'm sorry, operator, but Mr. Bass is on another line. Um, would you hold on? Thanks. Frank, Jim Barnett on line two, Australia, and uh, the Crusher and the Bruiser are here to see you. <laughs> well, either you're not Prince Charming or I'm not the good fairy. Try me. Sorry. <laughs> Did anybody ever tell you that you were very physical? Is that good? Not bad. See, I told you she liked me the best. Okay, Mr. Burnett, I'll take those dates down now. Uh, yes, and the 21st. Okay, thank you. To what do we owe this honor? Look, Crush, he's dead and he's still walking. That's right. Well, this is all I needed this morning. What do these gentlemen want, Debbie? Would you believe tickets, passports, and a visa to Japan? Oh, possibly. I slightly remember arranging something for them there. You guys leaving today? You know, we're going to leave in about three hours, but right now we're going down to work out. Why don't you come with us, Frank? You look like you could use a workout and steam bath. No, 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 no. No workout. But a steam bath sounds pretty good. Uh, you go on ahead, though. I got something else to do first. I'll meet you there. Okay, here's everything you need but your jock straps. <laughs> We're going to leave now, Frank, because we can't top that. <laughs> I think you'd better go. You know, if she was a lady wrestler, we'd all be in trouble. I know, I know. See ya, Frank, baby. Take it easy, Frank. They're playful pats are like pile drivers. Oh, you're just out of shape. You're so hell you would want to.